Hey, what's up everyone? Apple Ocean here and today in this video, this is a pretty darn serious video because YouTube offered to pay me. Uh, they sent me a letter offering to partner me with them. So, um, the way that this is going to work basically is that for the videos that I get, advertisements are going to be put on them. And for every click, I earn approximately a hundredth of a cent. Yeah, that's not too much. Um, so they pay me 55% of the total revenues. And off of some research that I did recently, I found out that in about a month from my video views, I'd earn maybe, what, $20? Yeah, um, except the problem with this is YouTube will not pay me unless I earn $100 because if they do that, they're just going to be losing money. So um, that's the way it's going to work. And I need to ask you guys about this because YouTube is serious for me. I, I really like making videos on here. Um, videos are pretty awesome, I love making them, but, uh, being offered to a job for making videos, that's a huge deal. Um, so, yeah, uh, <laughs> so, it's a big deal because I'm gonna be earning money from this if I do accept it. I'm not sure if I want to accept it or not. Because there's going to be all these advertisements on videos. Some of you guys use Adblock. It might not work. Um, yeah. You might not click on the ads or whatever. But that happens. So if you guys think that I should go about doing this, then let me know in the comments. This is a really, really big deal for me. I've known about it for a little while now, but I've just been putting it off. So, the way I found out was I just went over to um, my video manager and then there was a letter that told me uh, that I could be partnered with YouTube. So, yeah, now I'm going to go over the terms with you all, but let me know in the comments if you think that I should go along with it and just get paid. I mean... I don't mind getting paid, but then again, I'm only 14. I don't know what that's going to do for me. I mean, I'm not really looking for a job at the moment, but this is a once in a lifetime deal, I'm pretty sure. I don't know if YouTube's going to offer me again later or what. I mean, the only button here is okay, and I'm not sure if I want to hit that button. So here are the terms. Here we go. Together with the YouTube Terms of Service and YouTube Partner Program Policies, each of which may be updated from time to time and are incorporated by the HEI reign of reference, the following YouTube Partner Program terms apply to your participation in the YouTube Partner Program. The terms. Please read the terms carefully. If you do not understand or accept any of these terms, you should not upload content for monetization on YouTube. Monetization is the job, basically. Monetization is, hey, you get paid for making this video. Um, and that just says, hey, if you want to get a job, go ahead and accept these terms. But if you do not, then do not accept. Okay, here are, are the terms. One, monetization revenues. YouTube will pay you as follows. Advertising revenues. YouTube will pay you 55% of net revenues recognized from YouTube from ads displayed or streamed on YouTube um, or an authorized third party on content watch pages or in the YouTube video player in conjunction with the streaming of your content. So that basically says, hey, you watch the entire ad, boom, Nick gets money. Hey, you click on the ad, boom, Nick gets money. Stuff like that. So a big conspiculation or what what do you say misconspiculation i don't know um misunderstood 
part of YouTube is that you earn money from the number of subscribers you have, but that's completely false, as you can see here. Okay. YouTube is not obligated to display any advertisements alongside your video and may determine the type of format of ads available on the YouTube service. So, what does that say? Let me read that again. Um, YouTube is not saying, hey, we have to place these ads. You have to choose to place the ads. So, um, they're not saying, hey, you know what? We're going to place ads all over your videos. You have to say, I want this to happen. So, that's what that sentence says. For clarity, YouTube reserves the right to retain all other revenues derived from the YouTube service, including any revenues related to ads on search result pages. So um, that basically says, hey, you're looking for a saxophone, we're gonna give you an ad about a saxophone, stuff like that. Um, subscription revenues. YouTube will pay you 55% of total net revenues recognized from YouTube from subscription fees and attributable to the monthly views or watch time of your content as a percentage of monthly views or watch time of all or a subset of participating content and the relevant subscription offering as determined by YouTube. Basically, hey, you watch the ad, boom, money, stuff like that. If your content is included in and viewed by a user in multiple subscription offerings, YouTube will pay you based on the subscription offering with the highest amount of net revenues recognized by YouTube as calculated by YouTube. So that says, hey, you actually went out and bought what this advertisement told you to do. You get more money from that. So uh, those are the ways to get paid. Is there a lightning outside? It's like freaking sunny and summer. Anyways, payment account required. In order to receive payment and such, you must at all times have an AdSense account associated with your YouTube user account or accounts or such other payment as required by YouTube. YouTube does not owe you for any revenues that may be associated with content during any period of which you do not have a valid method of payment. So what that says is, hey, you gotta set up an AdSense account so that way you can actually get the money. But if you don't have it, YouTube's just going to keep all of that money because YouTube does that. Okay, payment terms, li limitations, and taxes. YouTube will pay you for any revenues due within approximately 60 days after the end of any calendar month. So long as, so long as, you earn, long as your earned balance is at least 100 US dollars or equivalent to its local currency, um, I'm in the U.S., guys, so 100 U.S. dollars at the time the payment is due. You are not entitled to earn or receive any revenues in connection with your content in any of the following circumstances. A. If one or more third party claims rights to a certain element of your content, except cases where YouTube's policies or system supports uh, sharing a portion of revenues with you, as determined by YouTube. So what that says is if you have copyright in the video, like copyright material, uh, such as copyrighted songs or music, or why songs and music, but copyrighted material such as um, movies that you've uploaded, stuff like that, then you are not allowed to make a YouTube video off of that or you can make one, you just won't get paid for it. So another circumstance is B, if monetization is disabled on your content by either you or YouTube, which says, hey, if you don't say that you wanna get paid for making this video, then you're not gonna get paid. Uh, or C, your participation in the YouTube Partner Program is suspended or terminated pursuant to section four below. YouTube will, uh, use reasonable efforts to notify you in any of these circumstances should occur. So um, that's what happened to David. His account got terminated. You can't get paid if you can't get your account working. And I'm not scared of how my account going down. I mean, if it does go down, 
uh, I'm I'm gonna be scared for life because I really like this account. But here is the termination section. Part four, termination. Either party may terminate these terms for convenience with 30 days prior to the written notice to the other, including via electronic means. YouTube may either suspend or terminate your participation in YouTube Partner Program immediately upon written notice, including via electronic means. If YouTube reasonably dis determines or suspects, suspects that you have violated the, these terms for clarity, uh, even or right <laughs> determines or suspects that you have violated these terms for clarity in the event of termination with the terms of youtube of service will survive and apply to your use of youtube service that says is hey you do not follow these terms you can get your account terminated for copyright or for misleading content stuff like that Okay, governing law, section five. The governing law and dispute resolution provisions of YouTube terms of service will also apply to these terms. And basically says, hey, you plagiarize this, you're going to jail or court or something. Um, stuff like that. So the real world applies to YouTube. Uh, section 6. Miscellaneous. Capitalized terms used but not defined in these terms will have the meanings to such terms in YouTube Terms of Service. These terms replace all previous or current agreements between you and YouTube relating the YouTube Partner Program, including any prior monetization agreements that are in effect between you and YouTube as of the effective date which for me is the 15th of June, so I'm kind of clutching this video, but it's the 12th currently. Okay. Except as modified term, except as modified by these terms, the YouTube terms of service remain in full force and effect. YouTube's right to modify or revise terms of service as described by these terms of service will also apply to these terms. So that's basically the letter that YouTube sent me. I'm not sure what I'm gonna be showing, guys, for like gameplay or something. I'm not sure if there's even gonna be gameplay, but this is serious stuff. Let me know in the comments if I should go along with doing it. I know it's a pretty long grant and such, but um, let me know, guys. This could be an opportunity for me I may not earn a hundred dollars, but then again, I might. So, anyways, guys, thanks for watching, and I'm depending on you guys for uh, telling me what I should do in this situation. So, anyways, guys, thanks for watching. I'll see y'all next time. Bye. Whoa! I just hit my keyboard.